Hi everyone, it's me Nikki here with my fall inspired home bar makeover. And today I wanna to share with you how I make over my home bar, which is located in my home office for the fall. You know, I think that you should have a space in your home where you can have a little setup to have a nice beverage when you come home from work or during the day or you know, whenever you wanna do it or if you have guests coming over. It doesn't have to be wine. If you don't drink wine in your home, that's totally fine. It can be coffee. You can set up a little coffee bar with you know pumpkin inspired, um, you know, accents and things like that or you know pumpkin um you know teas and things like that or you can have it um kid friendly if you don't have an actual physical bar if you have a sofa table transform that sofa table into kind of a fun um little area for a special treat for the fall it can even be a candy bar and i'll do a link to my fall candy bar video so that you can see that because that's a nice thing to do on your bar area or your um, sofa table and things like that during this time but what i'm going to do today is i'm going to show you how i transform this bar and this is how it currently looks for the fall and another important you know, factor of this video is I want to show you how I use my accessories in a multifunctional way. I love being able to buy a piece and use it 10 different ways around my home because I save so much money that way. I get different looks and different uses out of my accessories and it's just a lot of fun. So I'm hoping, hoping you can see that today and I'm hoping I can inspire you in that kind of way also. So we're going to get right into transforming this for the fall and it didn't take me that long. So now I've had this here and it's just a kind of um, wine, uh, you know, carafe here and not carafe it's kind of a wine bucket and I'm gonna just remove that I'm gonna sit the wine to the side and I'm actually gonna leave this wine out because it's a nice red it's a um, you can have a champagne there and then a German wine and so it's a nice mixture and then you know once we you know go through that during the holidays you know I'll pull something else out and put it up on the bar and so but that's gonna stay on the bar I'm gonna remove these accessories that I had here during the spring and um, these here now the, the books are gonna stay this is gonna go away but you know at home at work at, I'm sorry at work with Nikki is my other channel I'll put the link below but um, you can check out my video and I'll put the link to the video below of what these actually are and what purpose they are I have a DIY on what these actually are and so if you're curious to see what I use these for in my home office um, go check out that video and so they're going to stay because they are functional for my office I cannot move those and the lamp is gonna stay also but I'm gonna do a little tweak to that now this is the bar here now these are cake risers or um, cake plateaus or whatever you want to call them or cake plates or you know they have so many different names I bought this about a year ago from Ross I got them in three different sizes small medium and large I love them because they had that bronze look with the little sparkle that I love and they were really nice for a fall look and initially I thought oh this would be great for you know fall entertaining and things like that but then you know the other day I thought you know what I'm gonna use this on my bar to jazz it up bring in some fall little feel to it it brings in a nice little sparkle and so there'll be nice little risers and to give another you know another dimension to my um wine bottles and glasses and things like that and so I use the small one and I use the medium one and I use one to sit my wines up here and it's a nice little display for the wines again it brings that nice holiday festive look for the fall and a little bit of sparkle which you guys know I love my sparkle now this is a vase I got from my mother at Christmas and I love that it has a nice little sparkle on it which I love to bring in any aspect of my decor and it kind of it kind of plays off of the little cake stands there the little sparkles on the cake stand and I just throw some um fall inspired artificial little spray I have here and it's about I need to work with it I need to trim some of the wild ones off and I need to really do that but it brings in those fall colors and it you know totally transformed that little area there you know and so that brings in a sparkle along with the warm browns of the fall and plays off each other along with this wreath that I made and I just hung it using a, one of those 3M hooks on my mirror there to you know jazz up the mirror now these are actually napkin rings and these napkin rings I got from Havana Vintage and I'll put the link to that website below and if you're in the Northern Virginia area you definitely want to check out that store they have some of the most amazing amazing items and so I'm going to use these napkin rings as kind of jazzing up my bottle and you would never know that they're napkin rings once you put them around the bottle again having accessories that you can use in multifunctional ways are just awesome it's fun saves you money and it takes you a long way if I want to use them as napkin rings during Thanksgiving I can use them as napkin rings at Thanksgiving but now they're decorating my wine bottles 
And the glasses I had were these on here and I'm gonna replace them with these that I had got a couple years ago from World Market. I like them because, you know, it just gives another look, you know, because in your, when you're in your home every day, you see the same thing, you get tired of it. And now this gives me a new look and it kind of gets me in the fall mode. So I thought they would be a cute touch to the bar. So I put four of the glasses there on the small little cake plate um, or cake stand there. And I think it adds just such a cute and nice look. Now this, if you know, um, if you watched my video last year on how I did my fall candy bar, which of course I said I had linked that below, which I did, um, I had got these little emblems here, I think a pack of five or so from Michaels. And so this is an extra one I had here and I love it because again, fall tones, nice little sparkle, gives a nice little, you know, look. And I had it around the house very easy. Now what I'm going to do, and I'm going to just add it onto my little lamp here. You know, I've looked at this lamp all summer, but I wanna jazz it up to warm it up for the fall. So I'm just gonna pin this little emblem onto the center of the flower, number one, to give a different look, to warm it up for the fall. It doesn't damage my piece. I can take it off once the fall is over and put one that's more kind of Christmas inspired, you know, in December. But I think for now, that's really cute, really simple. Didn't cost any money, but it jazzed it up a little bit, gave me a different look for my office. Now my office is teal color. I have teals and neutrals in my office. And so this is one of those pumpkins that I got from Joann's and I loved it. It had a little country kind of stem on it and I ripped that off and put that little emblem um, in the center to fit more of my style. But I think it gives a subtle kind of pumpkin kind of fall look and it brings in actually the teal colors that are in my office so it brings it over to my bar so that's the main purpose of this too is actually to bring that in there and so you know just putting the kind of um, browns in there and kind of keeping the flow of the colors is what I'm you know doing there so I really loved it I just hot glued it in the center after I ripped out the um, little stem because the little stem was just not my style and it was like kind of country looking I just didn't like it and so um this is more of what I wanted, just something subtle, you know, you know, I just thought it was cute. And again, my office has those teal colors in it, so my accents are like my pumpkins are going to have that teal looking in, and that other uh, metal pumpkin there I had got from Pier 1 not too long ago. But I can then incorporate the browns and the teals and kind of jazz up my office for the fall without having to take my, um, you know, just adding in a color, not necessarily taking away a color. And so I had this little cream colored pumpkin here and this little silver stand I had, and so I'm going to use these on the bar to bring in more of the silver silver aspects and so I'm bringing that over here just to give another dimension another look and you know you kind of want to help with the flow keep with the flow sit it on top very simple had the pumpkin had the stand and now it just helps balance out my stand now right here I want these crystal um little um coasters and so I'm gonna get those those are on my to-do list to get because I've really been wanting them for a long time especially around the holidays and I'm gonna sit those right there and that's going to finish off my bar and so that way they have the coasters there it bring in the sparkle because they're crystal it'll bring in the sparkle and I think it's just a really really beautiful look and so this is just a quick way that I kind of um transform my home bar in my office for the fall. I had the things in my home. I repurposed things I had like the cake stands and the napkin rings, making them as decor for the bottles and as for um, stands for the wine glasses and the um, wine. And so again, using those things that I have that I typically wouldn't think to use for certain things, but you got so many things around your home you can do this with. And again, I did this wreath here, which was a little bit of burlap fabric and a ribbon that I had. And I just put it on, on my mirror just to kind of jazz up that for the fall. And so it just kind of warms up that little area and keeps with the tones that are in my office because I didn't want to overpower my office with a lot of oranges and a lot of fall colors, but I still wanted to have a fall feel without having to kind of, um, you know, just overdo it too much. And so by simply doing my bar in my office and a little bit of accents on my desk, it just really brought a cute little warm fall feel uh, to my little workspace. And so I hope you all have enjoyed my little quick makeover. I hope you're getting ready for the fall. I would like to thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And check me out on my social media uh, areas. I, you can keep up with me there. I hope you have a beautiful day. And this is Nikki saying goodbye.